I like NASCAR. I saw Steve Free Mini Pads ought to sponsor NASCAR just to hear the announcers. That'd be pretty good right there. Welcome to the Summer's Eve 200. The KY Jelly Car has just accelerated and easily slipped into the number two hole. The Vagisil car has been itching and burning rubber all season out there and is number one in the bush standings. <laughs> That's right. They got hard liquor sponsorship now, too, would you? That'd be another good race to hear. We just started the race, and the number seven Jack Daniels car has already slammed through the wall, followed closely by the Coca-Cola Chaser car. All 15 members of the Jose Cuervo car are still waiting on a jump start. <laughs> Could somebody please unhook the lawn maintenance trailer from the Jose Cuervo car? The leaves are blowing out when they go around turn two. <laughs> That's funny. I don't care who you are right there. <laughs> well, I like NASCAR. I was in Talladega. Last year, did you know the Viagra car is the only car that's got windshield wipers on the inside? <laughs> that's true. <laughs> but then people that mock NASCAR that don't understand. Look, if you don't understand a sport, don't talk about it bad. All right, I'll tell you something. You know what I mean? I was leaving, I'm going to tell you the story. I was leaving the hospital the other day. I go, man, we had a big shakeup in the family, but that ain't concern you. But uh, we was leaving the hospital. I was visiting my grandpa. He's getting uh, ovarian cancer. And, uh, yeah, I, he, we didn't even know it. Uh, he did have a lot of high heels. I do remember that, but I didn't think nothing of it. When he breastfed me, that was kind of weird. I didn't understand that. I knew there was something going on with him. But I'm leaving the hospital, and there's a little kid there coloring or something, but I had my NASCAR shirt on, and he goes, you NASCAR fan? I'm like, get her done. He's like, NASCAR ain't nothing but a bunch of mullet-headed rednecks drinking bush beer, watching cars go around circles all day. That's what he said. Piss me off. I went up to that little punk. I said, let me tell you something, you little turd. NASCAR's a lot more than that, all right? We also got Budweiser. <laughs> Get it up. <laughs> he heard that. I walked by him. I kind of smacked him upside the head a little bit. <laughs> he pissed me off. It's a wonder I didn't rip him out of his wheelchair. <laughs> hey, ain't nothing I hate worse than a cocky, crippled kid. I'll tell you that right now. You respect your elders. <laughs>